Hello and welcome back on Vivo Joe and this is War Custom Resources, a stormy, snowy night. At the end of this episode, I hope that we have our new Volspork actually planned, ready to go uh, to get built on, <laughs> if we're lucky. Uh, but reality is probably going to look different. But yeah, here's our city. Here's Rostock. They're doing a little bit of um, maintenance over there, I guess. Building is falling apart. You don't want that with your apartment complexes because people probably don't appreciate that. And all these little workers will just run away. It's still winter. I consider just letting it pass us by, but I don't think that's what we really need to do. A couple things that I forgot. Um, let's just see here. All of that is assigned. That's great, but it is winter, so none of this is getting done, which is super. Um, but we'll, we'll survive, I guess. And this one has already started. Oh, that's awesome. And the other construction is already here. I think this is something that I probably want to get built next, uh, just because of how everything works. And that should be fine. And yeah, some signaling over here will be helpful. But also getting through winter right now is something that I really, really, really like. Let's see, where are signals? Signals are... I'm not thinking about where the signals are. I'm thinking about what I want to place here. Uh, because it's not as obvious as it should be. So this one's the right one. Okay, <laughs> I got it. I'm, I'm so proud of myself. Uh, chain this signal this and then we can actually get into some really exciting stuff again because that's that's how this should work you go out you go in there you go and then some mixed signal probably just in the middle here so we have some room we shouldn't need a lot of trains on that side so that should not really be an issue but i would really like to have winter um actually done so we can do more things moving forward beautiful they're all happy that's all we want you again, just the just a fire station. Nobody cares about you. Uh, so that should be good. Happiness is fine. Unemployment is fine. Our population has not grown as much as I would like it to, which is a little sad, but that's okay. I guess we are creeping up there. So uh, things are okay as far as I'm concerned. And winter is about to be over. So that's good stuff. We haven't actually built these houses, um, but we're going to get there eventually. How are we doing over here? relatively full oh this is this is a nice site this is a wonderful site this is exactly what we want to see um you don't have crimes patrolled yet do we i not have a police station here i don't think i well hold on fire station fire station you probably need something um to do here level 35 is actually a good one level 19 sure why not get get two vehicles um this should make life relatively easy do we have a fuel station somewhere nearby i, I don't remember I don't see one. Um, that's not good. Can we build one? Yes, we can. Uh, should we build one? I don't know. Build one here. Yep, let's do that. Uh, give me roads, vehicles, road cargo station, just a simple fuel station. It doesn't have to be complicated. It just has to be connected to a power station. Um, this should be fine. Construction office one. Get on the job and then life should be okay. Are all of you guys getting your own fuel? Yes, you are. Well, that's a luxury, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, I would really like to build this, but we don't... Ideally, we don't have time for that today because winter is about to be over. Surprised that we don't have as much money as I thought I would have, but that's okay. It looks like I don't have signals done here yet. Nope, no signals at all. Well, that's unfortunate. Let's fix that because that train is probably blocking something or will be blocking something in um, very soon. I would like to get these two actually done. Um, by that I mean delete it. Let's get those assigned. Great. And once they're done, they should be able to... I, I should be able to put more signals in here because this whole thing right now is completely unsignaled. Cool. Um, deconstruction. Please go out here. Are you assigned already? Nope. Yes, you are. Because you have a purple purple thing around it. Isn't that, isn't that super helpful? Um, F3. Yes, I didn't think I had this already built so construction office two if you could well construction office no two two is going to be fast faster here uh, than anything else that i can build so let's get all of those assigned to this so we don't have a water problem again and embarrassingly run out of things and life should be pretty good let's expand you and then uh, let's build a new city we do need a bigger city for this one right yes i think so uh construction office two you do this one Cool. Let's move out. 
Uh, winter is over, so stuff should move faster. That's fine. I don't really want to do gravel roads until this thing is ready to um, do something, but that's going to take a little while until all of this stuff is done. But hey, needs must, so that's fine. City! Let's build a city. This is Wolfs uh, Wolfsburg, so let's figure out what we're going to do here. How big do we need the city to be? That's a very simple question to answer, really, right? Um, do I want a train station in here? <laughs> that's that's an excellent question to ask, which we sh probably should have figured out before. Oh, this, this, also, this feels like a tram line more than anything else, but... Um, very tempting. I swear I have a plan every once in a while. Um, it's just not that important anymore because we do have the money, so that's great. Vaccine deployment, development, sure. Let's get that one going over there. Okay, what I want the mode of transport to be to move these people over here. We need, for the advanced industry vehicle production line, we need 500 workers. So 1,000 per trip, uh, which then translates to um, a lot. <laughs> this, this almost feels like a metro situation because 1,000 workers per shift, that's a lot of stuff. We have to triple that even quadruple it so four times that is what we need uh workers just available to be able to run this stuff that is four thousand people i think a metro is not it's not really it's not really out of the question here the the only thing that we have to answer is do we want an underground metro or above ground metro and this it, it can run into the same place now we can have some supporting trains coming in here um that also take care of things we can also have a separate train uh, train station sitting next to this because there's a lot of room we can even make this part of both networks the trains come in here and then if they have to go back to the city they just take a different way out all of those things are very val very valid i think a tram could be a solution but yeah this this does require a lot of workers and we could use the space over here to do um some other some other um well, production. What do I have here? There's iron sitting there. There's oil sitting where we are. We can probably use that if we want to. Where's coal? Coal is out there. So I, I was planning on doing iron and coal right here, which I still want to keep there, but that means we may do mechanical components in the middle. That could be an option, uh, but it doesn't have to be necessarily right here. It could be right there if we wanted to. Okay, so I need 4,000 people just to do um, the vehicle factory. Then I need another 1,000 thousand for peripherals to keep those people happy. I think that is fair. Um, are my fuel stations done? No, they're still not done. Gosh, hurry up. Um, you are high priority, so it shouldn't be a problem. But So I need 5,000 just to get that going. And then another couple thousand. Let's, let's just make this a 7,500 um, people town. Uh, and that should get us going. So let's build out the city. And we want to start with keeping the center nice and centralized. So either we keep this or we make this a center and build a star around it. I kind of like the roundabouts. They make life a little easier. I don't know that we really need to do that right now. But if I do this, we have an inner star and an outer star. This is not very um, scientifically laid out. And it's not actually following the same... Um, <laughs> the same whiff, which is true. Yes, you're right. Can I do this a little better? I think I can. Um, oh, oh yeah, I can. I can 100% do that because here's the thing. I could, what could you? I could do, could do this. We could build one out here. 90 meters. No, we don't need that much. Like 80 meters, 85 meters is probably fine. Um, the problem is I don't get the distance from here. Okay. So I can't do that. Something that I could do... You make this really complicated. Yes. Yes, I am. Um, <laughs> it's totally worth it. I cannot get the measurement like this. So I would have to do this every time with this measurement tool. You know what? That's fine. Um, 85 meters from there is where we're going to start. That doesn't help you at all. Okay. <laughs> okay. Oh. Oh, here's something I can do. Uh, I can put a road connection from here gosh this is more complicated than i wanted it to be uh there you go 76 meters there 76 meters here that that will do uh 76 meters here 79 75 i guess and and so on and that will get us close enough to an almost circle 73 77 
and then just a couple more yeah i like this i like this a lot 77 again there again 76 is our, our starting point and 75 right here okay having those should give us a starting point that we cannot actually connect past <laughs> just, just super helpful as usual okay uh, well, this is what I actually want to be able to connect to that, but this node is probably not going to stay exactly where I want you to be. Can you go back here? Yes, you can. Okay. All right. This is this is going to work. This is a little more tedious than I needed it to be, but it's fine. We're going to survive. Um, just have to remember where that node is that all that started all of this. So you there, you there, you there. Just one more. Okay, and since all of these are connected in a way that kind of makes sense, does that node stay here when I take this away? I think the answer is going to be nope, um, and that is okay. Maybe we're just going to use use all those nodes anyways. Should we do that? Okay, let's test something. If I take you away, that node goes away. Okay, well, um, that was that experiment. <laughs> I think there was a time back in, uh, in in this game where all the nodes actually stayed and there was no way to remove them maybe that was a better time then for what i'm trying to do now but this is fine i'm just going to do this then remove all the uh the nonsense in the middle here because none of this is actually needed anymore this was just to get um our thing set up yeah i like it i like it that's real real city planning uh turn the star into a bigger star love it that one that one oh yeah we're we're doing things we're doing we're doing very honorable things okay that's all done cool so we have a little center of the city and we have a little star on the outside of the city they're not completely aligned no i'm not going to do that for the whole thing no 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 <laughs> it's, it's, it's not worth it you could <laughs> you could do that by just pulling as far as you as you do everywhere make that approximately a, a, um, like a, a thing honestly it's really just this one that's a little closer and this one that's a little closer no stop it don't do it it's not worth it it's not what we're going to do on this channel okay fine the center is going to be looking exactly like this let's start building something um let's do a shopping center are my i'm just looking for these to be done because once these are both done i can assign my rare construction office to do a little more work and that's what i'm looking for right now uh you guys can you go out here and continue oh you're already assigned to it oh that's wonderful building's on fire do i have to worry about you Honestly, don't know. No, there's there's at least one tank coming from over here, so they should be all fine. All of these are fire covered now. Okay. Um, yeah, we're good. Everything is fine. Are you full of fuel? No, you have nothing. Okay. This this all looks fine. We're good. Um, continuation. Yes. Where are we? We're out here. Okay. Let's build the city. Uh, let's start with our central shopping center as usual just the big one that just barely fits in here but that should be fine i would like you to connect to that road and there's a simple reason for that i need this to be the su a supply road for the city because all of our stuff is going to be here and i just want a straight shot for all of our supply vehicles to go there and nothing else like i don't want to block this road which means this can potentially turn into either a bridge or a tunnel i'm not opposed to either of those situations but also this road could be uh, the same thing maybe maybe we'll do something about this later i don't know yet so that one has to go there i still like the uh, meat storage hack that, that i started doing not too long ago um sadly it looks like i'm not going to be able to get both of this uh quite exactly where i want it so let's try this again move the shopping center just a little further rotate rotate um just right there maybe just has to be a little further away than what it was a second ago we can probably get this connection a little better too you go away you go in there make it curvy so trucks can just drive in there nice and fast uh general cargo yes meat storage yes all of those things and then i wouldn't mind if you're actually um, attached to this side, because they're... Oh, come on. Do your thing. Really? You're not going to connect, though, so I probably have to do you like this. Okay, fine. Whatever. Well, don't sweat it. It's fine. Because we're going to drop off here by dropping off into the, uh, into the store. Okay, that's the first one. Now I want 
a continuation road from here. And honestly, I don't think it will be hurtful to have this road continue uh, through the center of town. That's fine. Uh, just right behind the store and have the bus stop right behind you. This is 7,500 people at least. So should I just go with the biggest one right away or with the medium one? 800 versus the biggest one. Oh, oh. If I do this as a metro, do I need a bus stop? Yes, I, I still need a bus stop. Uh, 100%, but I don't need the biggest one. It doesn't have to... It, it is not our main source of transport for most of our people. So, don't don't use this one. We could go here. I could even go super old school and get one of these really old big ones, uh, big bus stations. But you're not going to extend our walking range. So if I want to do that, I do need a bus stop that actually fits in here. Yes, this one will totally fit. Uh, and we'll do all the things that we need. And this bus stop will just take care of all the peripheral needs. So people can walk here to get into walking range of all the other places, whatever they care about. We could even assign people that are here to the tram metro station. I'm really intrigued by metro right now. I mean, we, we've done it before. It's totally fine. Everything is great. But we've never... I haven't used it in this season, so I kind of want to do it. So either this is a bus station... Or I turn you straight into a metro station, and I kind of really like that. We could do metro on level. Uh, that's not very helpful, 900 people here. We could do this metro station with an entrance. 600 people is relatively small, um, but it could be an option because it, it, it probably would look nice in, in this whole scenario. So I kind of like that. I would like it more if we can put it with... All these locations at the same or with all those things there at the same time 800 metro station without entrance okay this would make life a little easier because we can actually place this as part of the central central thingy here and we have another road connection there that's not bad we can have footpath connections to get all our workers in here I am so tempted to put this in here. This could also go right here, and that would be fine. Uh, the underground connections are a little more complicated from here, but not impossible to do. Huh. Gosh, this, this is harder than it needs to be. could also fit right here. <laughs> could totally fit right here uh, to get all our passengers in. I like this location. I really do, because it's not going to block anything else. It gives us all the footpath connections that anyone would ever care about. And life should be okay. If we put you there, and don't need this piece for sure, have you, don't need this piece, have you come out somewhere over here and turn into an above ground metro? Because I don't want to tunnel the whole metro, but in the middle of the city, and a, a below ground metro makes sense. Metros cannot use normal rail. So we have to remember that. And metros also do not like to cross other things. So they either have to be above ground or below ground. So either we're going to do tunnel all the way over here, and then tunnel again right after, or we do an elevated station. Now, now I want to do an elevated station. These don't have to be big. These just have to be uh, big enough. So metro above ground station, small. That is fine. I don't think by default I'm going to be able to get you the connections that I want. You look really ugly when I have the long metros running, though. So how about we do get a... Um, above ground station like this we're, we're going to be able to connect all the all the road connections wherever we need them so i'm not going to be worried about that right now uh, i would like to integrate the road with with what we have going on here i don't think i'm going to get that okay doing doing mental mental gymnastics here this i don't think this station is really required i can move the normal rail station over here um and have this metro just be part of the thing I'm, I'm gonna do that let's take all of this back uh just up till there take all of this back um till about here that should be fine um uh, even a little little more angled than i need you to be this is not very straight okay um how about we take that one back too then sounds great let's do that all the way probably down to here even that should be fine can even take you back a little further because the angle may be may get really ugly so if i take you away yes 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 
um, and then get the metro station in here. The above ground one just makes our life a tiny bit easier. And maybe that's a good thing. Maybe it's a bad thing. Uh, but plop you nice and close. You, you don't have a center. You just, yeah, you, you're kind of the same on both sides. And with that, we can actually change this. Um, sure, we'll, we'll take all of that away. That's just a gravel road. There's nothing complicated here. And then metro, you can become this connection. Don't hate it. Um, then number four four is my footpath you can do that um probably that and then oh this is an above ground oh i forgot that the metro stations do that they have an above ground and a below ground connection i don't think this yeah this is not a through station it's still just a normal connection can i wasn't sure no i can't okay so if this is an above ground connection um should we use that to never actually cross the road here to do that, we would need a, um, a footpath connection, obviously, and that footpath connection has to get in here somewhere. This is completely unnecessary, not really a thing that we... we No, this is completely necessary because we have no idea how we want to... Oh, boy. Is this going to work? We have no idea how we want to um, move our citizens around. So if I want to do this, I would have to move one of these factories a little further away that's not the end of the world okay let's get let's get rid of all of this we have a road right here and this thing right here this is not really important um is either of you more aligned than the other no let's take this one out uh take that one away get our advanced industries vehicle production line very good is it just a rotation yes just a rotation for you you're still aligned with that thing there should be more than enough room now to connect to this get a factory connection in there it should be good get a footpath connection here um that connects to something okay there's an awkwardness here because this still has to be connected to a road for maintenance and other needs okay let's see if we can still do what i want to do here otherwise we may just have to undo what i just did um, this industrial area, so steel, is going to be um, our, our method of choice. Get you there. Can I get a footpath out of here? I think the answer is yes. It's just a little finicky. Um, F4. Okay. Yes. As long as I can do that, we should be fine with the rest that we're doing. So now I need the road connection to just run here. That looks fine. Gives us a nice straight piece to connect to. Um, and then you just move into this or merge into this one eventually. That looks good. That looks good. Okay. Um, then back to the metro. Metro, metro, metro. Get this one connected. Um, have a nice uh, footpath connection right here. And get more. Get the actual pedestrian bridge to connect to this guy. You didn't put it in straight, really. <laughs> you did all of this work to not get to the thing that you actually wanted to do here. Um, that's just great planning right there. Oh, this thing is not very straight. Okay, um, that's something I can adjust, I think. Take you back just a little further, and then we'll see how this works. Uh, you, yes. Something like this, nice and straight. That's how far you can go. Can you still pass this one? Yes. Can you still pass that one? Yes. Okay. Um, then trains, metro station, like so. That looks relatively straight. Not perfectly straight, but relatively straight. Cool. Um, let's get our pedestrian bridge overpass. Beautiful. That that looks like if people want to work, they're just like, oh, this is the place to work. This is good stuff. All right, that's the first one. Um, let's get a normal train platform again that we had before and connect you to here. You're just going to run in parallel. People can just get off right there and then uh, connect into uh, the workplace out here. That should be fine. Um, and then we get all those connections that we had before. That's great. Uh, railroad, railroad, railroad. You can go in there all the way to here. Sure. A little sharper turn uh, than what we had before, but it's not the end of the world. That looks fine. Give me a nice long piece F4 to do the snapping in there. So far, so good. You just be more round. It looks like a really abrupt turn. Don't like it. Uh, yeah. Okay. Oh, that's good. That's good. And then this one, nice and long, smooth turn. 
Yes, I like it. Just giving myself enough room here for making sure that I can put a signal there. So, now we have Metro started. <laughs> cool, now we actually have to use it. Um, start construction on those pieces. Sure, why not? How's it going over here? This is done. Are you assigned yet? You are not assigned yet. You are also not assigned. So we're just out of range for our construction office. That's fine because we can just go, go ahead and do manual things now. Because once they're connected to one of the pieces, they usually can continue going um, until stuff, stuff is needed. Uh, with everything that's going on here, I think I would like to add another crossing right here. Put that as high priority and uh, get things done a little faster. Where are you? You're here now. Get over here. Get this one assigned. Get both of those um, higher priority and the other one also higher priority. Very good. So they should be getting those done relatively soon and then we can keep moving without big issues. Oh, this one is done. That's awesome. This one is also done. That's awesome. Everything is done. Those are all awesome things to see. How about you get those things done while you're here? Because that will be important. We have this bitumen tank. Okay. Yeah, with that with that thingy connection uh, right below it. That will be good. Love it. Love what we're doing here. Uh, you can even start getting this one built. <laughs> Why? <laughs> There's absolutely no reason to do that. You're right. Um, so, Construction Office 2, if you really have nothing to do right now, um, what should we do with you? Let's see. We have a lot of stuff over here that we need. Oh, we need this one actually planned out and built. No, honestly, just start building things again over here, uh, because you can. Uh, there's just a couple things that we still have left that need to get done. But that would be lovely. Yep, all of those, so we can actually start using our recycling. Not sure why this is still not done. F3. Whatever. It's going to get done now. Um, and all of this is fine. You can probably start constructing a little bit more in this area. How about construction office one? Can you get that done, please? I mean, I told you that forever ago. Not sure why that's so hard. But this is good. Uh, how are you doing? You would like to get more births again. We have 20,000 people now. All of that is really, really good. So yeah, we have this one connected. Metro. Metro is not that simple because Metro needs special connections to be able to do the things and the connections that you want, you can only put on the ground, sadly. So how are we going to do all of this? It's an excellent question. Yeah, you can, you cannot, you cannot, um, you cannot fork anywhere but on the ground, which makes me think oh, this road is fine. Okay, let, let, let's see how this looks because we have to connect this to something. Metro track, don't need that yet, but we do need this. If we just say that this one can turn around here. I don't think I hate that. Because it's, it is exactly doing what I would expect it to do. I think the Metro is definitely tall enough to do electrified rail running underneath it. And now it looks like it's part of, the, of this whole network, part of the whole plan. Don't hate it. So we're going to leave that. Um, then you just have to cross all of this relatively straight is fine or a little bit of a curve because there's a road here that has a curve. Yeah, that looks better. Um, you do the same thing. I don't know if you can tell, but the metro lines are directional. Um, they also go in and out direction of the of the stations. Um, and even though these don't look like they're connected, they are definitely connected. So getting you here should be fine. I would really like to have the um the metro pillars next to each other though and that's not happening here so let's try that again um the pillars are just a little funky because they're they're going a little longer here okay if we do the metro from this side can we get the same pillars no no we cannot okay metros do not need signals if that is something you're worried about but i look at those look at those thingies Okay, if we try to do the exact same thing from here, do we have any better luck? Not like that, but like this. Oh yeah, this looks better. That looks a lot better. Those metro pillars are actually aligning. Kind of. They're off by like a meter. Ah, transport fever, you do better at this than this game, I can tell you that. But that's fine. So we're almost, we're almost there. Is it worth trying this again? Hmm... I mean, we can pretend that it's the same, but it really isn't. Okay. All right, here's what we're going to do. Get rid of one of these again, that one. Then give me just a real connection like we had. There you go. Um, all the way out to here. 
give myself a lot of room for the next pillar that we're going to place there. Then do the same thing from this side, and hopefully the pillar so far should align. Not even close. Well, they're relatively close, but not close enough. Okay. If I do the pillars again from this side, is that any better? I don't like that I keep doing the same thing here. I'd just like to show you the result of what all this pain is causing me, but that's fine. It does not like where that pillar was. Okay, that's fine. We'll do it again. Uh, you, at least we're keeping the curve that I like. You do this thing, and now, now are the pillars aligned? Yeah, look at that. The pillars are actually next to each other now. That's that's beautiful. Um, Metro does not have... Ooh, Metro does have a fancy truss bridge. That is something I wasn't aware of, because if we have this, we should get a lot better pillar placement for this kind of behavior. Yes, I like it. And now we can use whatever we want to get our Metro down. We could build a mount, like I usually do, or we could allow the Metro to just be a Metro and run, run into the ground. I think that will be fine. Okay, watch this. Uh, let's do Metro Tunnel. We will need Metro Tunnel behavior and all that stuff here down the road, but for right now, this should be fine. I just want this Metro Tunnel to continue underground until about here. Where can you come out? Okay, you don't want to come out yet. We are six meters below ground. Now come up. Tunnels above the terrain. Yeah, that's the whole point. <laughs> why is this Why is this even a, a, a an option to be a problem? Tunnels above the terrain at some point. Um, you're making this really hard. Unnecessary. Planning metro shouldn't be this complicated. Tunnels above the terrain at some stage. Tunnel above the terrain. What are you... Seriously, that's what I'm trying to do. There's a tunnel. Seems a little weird, but all right, I believe you. Uh, tunnels above the terrain everywhere. Great. Get you close to this. Um, nope. Yes. You come all the way out here. And then up here. Nope. Don't like it. Okay. <laughs> this, 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 this does not need to be this complicated, I can tell you that. Uh, take all of this back just a little bit. Make sure that the road does not get deleted while we do that. Uh, run a little bit forward. There you go. Keep all of this nice and tidy. Oh, game. Oh. No, come on. There you go. We did it. And now come up. Uh, e. E to build the tunnel up here. And you do the same thing here, right? Yes, good. Cool. Whew. That was a hard berth. Um, let's get some regular Metro track. And this is the important one because this is going to give us all the connections that we want. Okay. So you, we just need a little bit of straight track, a little bit of straight track here, okay. Then uh, the bridge has to do something here. Okay, can you get a smooth enough connection into there? I think I would call that smooth enough. Um, is it perfect? Probably not. How the pillars, the pillars are actually lined. That, that's actually pretty. And the, the slope is not ridiculously steep. So that's all good. Now I would like um, the connection here. And the only way you're going to get a connection is to actually... Um, <clears throat> oh, I forgot. You actually have to use the metro, metro tracks, to get out of what you're doing here. And we're just going to do it like this. Nice little snake. And then you can use regular, uh, like regular concrete rail uh, to do the other stuff. And one of them would have to connect out, like this way. And one of them would have to connect the other way. There's a little kink in the in the dirt road that I would like to fix if we're doing this. Yes, that's the kink. Um, terrain level from this side because we have rail coming through now. That's great. Actually, can we just get it level to that side? That makes sense. And then uh, rail again. You come all the way over here and into there. This is just metro rail. It doesn't have to be complicated. This is going to be a way out. For whoever works here, which is just going to be uh, rear construction cranes and all that stuff. That should be fine. The road here should still exist because it's our connection for the fire station. Um, and that should be good. So metro is here. Good. What do we need for the metro? We need an end station. And the end station could possibly exist above ground or below ground. There's no... I don't have to pick and choose here. Should I build a... Oh. 
I can probably pull a rare construction office out here. We're already really far away, and this is not a bad place for it. And you actually have connections now to everything. It would be good. It would be very good. Um, should we do that? I think so. I just want to make sure that we are in semi-walking distance of that place over there. So let's see that we get that. <laughs> I really wanted to do um, the city today, but if this is what we're going to do, then that's just not going to happen. Uh, 360 meters. So yeah, if I put a reconstruction office right here, it will totally work with everything that I want to do here. So let's do that. Um, another large one. Um, flip you around because I don't like where the road connection is. There you go. Now I don't like where the gravel connections are. Um, this is fine. Um, yeah, road connections on that side, gravel connection on that side. Reconstruction office, you look happy. Okay, so if you go this way, then I still need a gravel source. I'm trying to think if there's a way I can hook into this. I think the answer is probably. Um, but do I want to do that right now? Or do I want to stay on that side? I can probably put the rare construction office somewhere over here. Oh, if, if I can fit you in there, I probably should. No. Hmm. <laughs> this, is comp this is more complex than I need it to be. Um, if I can put you here. Uh, hmm. Yeah, I, I don't think there's enough room to put any of my, uh, of my shebang over there. And over here, we're just too far away. So either I put you here and deliver gravel that way, or I put you over here and just accept that this is going to be the place that's not perfect, but it's good enough. I think we're going to go not perfect, but good enough. Very good. Aggregates, um, aggregate storage, at least a thousand tons is what I want here. And I want you to be able to load and unload. Um, that will be important for, uh, for different reasons. So we put that one here and get another conveyor belt down here overlaps with existing construction are you kidding me oh you crossed <laughs> you crossed the opposite way of what i need you to do uh got it so if that one goes in here or that one goes this one yeah sure this will work you go there then eight uh eight is my shortcut to conveyor key uh, conveyor connections those go there they can now load and unload however they want that should work um, road connection there is not super important yet. I wish this was drive through, but it's not. Um, and then, yeah, just a quick warehouse. Don't need a big one. Okay, get a small one. Uh, is that too small? Maybe. Let's get a medium sized warehouse. Okay, we're not going to do anything in the back here besides get people. Um, so this should be, should generally be okay. Sure. Yeah, that rail is not going to be hooked up to anything. Um, then there's a footpath here that will just go from there to here and will eventually connect up into this section. That's nice. The road is right here, so that has to be boxed out. There you go. Uh, footpath again. There you go. Beautiful. And now we just need one more thing, which is just a open storage. We don't need anything big here. Um, how much steel do we? How much? How much steel do we actually store there? 300 tons of steel, plus whatever is stored inside the big construction office. I don't think there's any need really for the things that I'm adding, uh, but I want to. So there you go. There you go. Uh, there you go. And there you go. Cool. So all of this is kind of hooked up. Let's get the last things. Uh, one in and one out track. Uh, something like that and something like this. That gets all the things connected. Well, too many lines. That gets all those things connected, and that makes me happy. I really like that bridge right there. That's That, that makes me... Uh, I think that's the right place to put it. A rail depot may not be a bad idea in this area because we're going to do more stuff, and we have to put the, uh, the metro somewhere. Okay, if you want a, ma a rail depot, where would you put it? It has to have access to all the things, and it has to be able to turn around if we want to. Also, a rail depot would be nice to have direct access to the metro tracks. Otherwise, we can't get um, metro rails um, into on, onto the rail track. Okay. Okay, I'm glad I remember that because that was not something that's on my on my list of to dos here. So, uh, get another depot. Yes. Um, if we put you here, I think it will be fine because all we have to do is just extend. Um, the rail, the, the metro rail track just a little bit because we can drive on it. That's not a problem. 
We can do the things that we need to do on it. This is fine. Um, then give me Metro Track on the back of this. Yes. Um, some other infrastructures in the way. Okay. Yeah, Metro Track does not want to uh, connect to to regular tracks, so that's what it's complaining about right now. Um, Metro, you here. I'm not convinced that this is all Metro Track. I think it is all Metro Track, but the notes don't really make me confident in that. So have you come out again and you come out again? Then you continue all the way to here. Yes, this is going to work just fine. Uh, could you be the same length? <laughs> just could you try to be? That'd be great. Uh, five. Yes. Uh, then Metro Track. Yes. Can I get close enough to see a difference? Yes, there's these little white boxes on the side that tell me that is Metro Track and this is not Metro Track. Okay. Uh, you can continue all the way to here. That looks fine. And then you just have to feed into this because this is our metro hookup. And on the other... Okay, good. It is, it is the correct metro rail. I'm looking at how these are aligned to each other. And it would be really cool if they would all align from the other side. But I don't think we're going to get that. That's yeah, fine. <laughs> it's, it's, it's fine. Leave it alone. Then you uh, will just be a part of this. This is a more busy junction than what I probably want it to be, uh, but it should be fine because it's only going to be deliveries. It's not going to be something crazy. So that's good, I think. They can do all the things that they want to do. Um, and Metro is part of our system now, almost. Um, there is something very important that we still have to do. Do I see some... I think I see some trains parked here and nothing is working. Yes, yes, that's what's happening. Uh, you have to go home. Thank you. Then you can go in there. Thank you. Uh, the rail over here is done. That's awesome. Chain that up. Uh, like that and like this. Get me some mixed rail uh, signals right here. Yeah, we're just going to signal this out right away because if we don't, um, things are going to be pretty slow. You go there, you go there, you go there, you go there, you go there. Then this is becoming an actual rail traffic thingy. Um, so you just remove these crossovers. You shouldn't do that yet. Okay. Can I still cancel this? Cancel, suspend demolition, cancel demolition. That's what I want. Okay. Because we still want to electrify all of this. Um, it's just going to be a little later. So that's fine. Do that right now. I could do that right now. Uh, let's get all the rail down. And then we'll do the electrification at the very, very end. Oh, you'll be fine. Okay. Let's do that. Um, yes, you're fine, you're fine, you're fine. And then let's do the last couple signals here. Uh, mixed signal. We already have some here. You're just all pointing to the same place. And the problem is they kind of all interfere with each other. That's fine. Are there signals here? No. Okay, the, uh, the, the problem was right here. Got it. That's a chain signal. That's a chain signal. Okay, that should be fine. No chain signals. Yeah, no, this is good. Um, so they can start building all of those things until they get out here, and eventually um, we can separate them a little more. Okay. I don't think... I, I do have one locomotive waiting there. Okay. Okay. Let's do it. Um, I, I was considering if I should really add more signals here, and I think the answer for right now is going to be, sure. Just add all the signals because now that train can go wherever it wants to go and we can do a little more construction at the same time. I think that's useful. All right, so this is here. This is here. We have Metro started. This Metro only has one stop right now. Is that a problem? I hope not. And here's my other thing. I think we're just going to do a Metro Underground Station uh, because we can. Metro End Station like this. Um, road connection. Let's, let's put the road connection outside of the city so we're not taking up any valuable uh city space let's just continue this road a little bit get you connected to that that looks great metro tunnel f3 for underground um get you in there and you in here and the metros will just come in and again because everything is one way metro will just park there and then we'll just shoot out the other way and it knows which way is the right direction that should all be fine um we'll probably just put signals here if we can, yeah, we're just going to put signals here so it's disconnected from the rest of the rail network, and that should all be great. Okay, I love it. That, that's working. There's a problem over there, not just something that needs maintenance. Well, they always need maintenance because reasons. 
Speaking of which, maintenance. Yes, <laughs> let's, let's add a maintenance office to this spot too because we have a lot of room right here. I'm sure we're also missing something else, but I can't remember what it was. Uh, large maintenance office, please and thank you. This this size seems appropriate. Um, we could make it connect to some other, um, some other offices or some construction offices of of sorts, but I really don't want to. It doesn't matter. It's fine. Just just go to the places and repair them because at some point construction is going to be done and then we don't need anything anymore. How much storage do you have? Not that much, so let's give you a quick warehouse and a uh, station, and then we should be fine. Um, the next size warehouse up, like this one. Um, all materials will come from somewhere over here, so they should be fine. Get me a large open storage. Uh, T, flip that around. There you go. Um, really? There you go. And get you in here, and then life should be pretty good. All right. Ooh. <laughs> nothing complicated it's just something that has to be done great let's go back to the city how much time did i spend on just trying to put a metro in there way too much but i think we can get something done in like 15 minutes for the rest of the city so now we have a bus station we have a metro station somewhere here there's there's the road connection cool um for the metro station i should probably not ignore this we do need footpath connections that go to this station and the only way to do that is with subterranean tunnels which is this guy. Um, you will not be able to just do this because the rail currently is in your way. So we have to go up. I think we are actually creating, yeah, we are creating a tunnel exit, which is wonderful. So if we put one here and put one, there's a road right there. That's why it's not letting me do it. If we put one there and then maybe we can do this. Okay, now we're under the road. That's great. Uh, and just pop up a little bit. Okay, those are connected now. Um, now we have to just question ourselves. Do we want a direct connection to this? Or are we fine with uh, where they are now? Because they can probably be reached by most people. Sadly, not all of them because of how it's placed. But in the end, we can just tell them to go uh, to where we need them. So if we make this go down... Just need to go down enough to make it underneath that rail connection, which it looks like it doesn't want to do right now. That's fine. Yeah. Hmm. Hmm. I think I'm going to do this. Having one extra connection over here is not going to hurt us. So... And I think we're just going to use a, a quicker up. So pedestrian en entrance, metro stairs. This should be fine. F3 gives me a little better overview, maybe. Uh, right there. Honestly, this is what we're going to do. Just point it this way. F3, you can take this one away. Point it this way. Just look nice in the corner. There we go. Then give me the pedestrian tunnel that can connect to what already exists here. And now we can just put a nice uh, footpath right across here. And then we have all the connections uh, that anyone would ever ask for. So that's good. That's working. Um, then obviously, let's do the monument right away, which can be right here. Perfect place for it. Uh, we're going to do all the path footpath connections later. And I'm not even sure I'm going to show you what we're going to do there. And because we're here, maybe... So we already placed that. Let's place... What's this one? Uh, it doesn't have any... Um, any loyalty influence let's put this one here and then it's relatively nice cool center of town almost finished now we just need all the peripherals let's go down our normal list uh we already built a restaurant all that stuff don't need that again uh cinema yes i would like that you can go somewhere in this area and moving on uh we've always built the gallery of art this can be a little bit of a different place let's find something in tourism that we like um, the carousel? Sure, but I think they're limited to what time of the year. The side tower for the city? Sure, yes, I like this. Um, I wouldn't mind... We're, we're going to add this later. I don't know what I want yet, but something we can add. I also just saw something. I think I would like a TV station at some point. This doesn't have to be in the middle of the city, uh, but we do need it uh, connected to something. So putting that here 
may be fine and appropriate for for everything that we want to do this is actually 400 meters now from from that location i should triple check because if it's not i am probably going to mess with whatever i'm trying to do so if we go there there to here 250 meters okay we have a lot more room that's what i thought yeah this this looked like we're just too close that's fine take that one back and take this one back um so that's 250 meters I, I would say right where that place is is probably closer this is 290 300 some meters this is where we want to end up okay what did i do didn't i do 400 meter um scenarios earlier 330 maybe i just what did i do here why is this why is this so far away from center 329 at least as long as we do that 300 there um i guess we'll keep that one going 300 here 318 that's fine um and then 300 there that's fine yeah the only one that's not 300 was this one and you're effectively 300 right on that node, which is honestly a pretty good place for that. You just don't want to do that right away. That's fine. F4. Get the angle that we want. Connect to that thing. And then you just jump up on this side. And now life is good again. Cool. It's it's it's, it's more symmetrical now. So people should be happy. So if that is almost 400 meters, I think it's pretty easy to add our TV station right here. I'm not sure when we're going to build it, but having this as part of the city, I do not mind one bit. So let's let's just do this. Uh, sure, right there is fine. Um, yeah, do, do the terraforming. A little more terraforming than I expected, but that's fine. So get you here on that outskirt. Um, indoor pool, obviously, always always required, always necessary. Put it across from um, the, the, there we go. Put it across from the subway station, and that should be fine. And then we have all of this taken care of. I may add a couple more things of that. Uh, we already have a fire station. We don't have a hospital. Hospitals can be, what is this? Oh, uh, the, the footpath exit. <laughs> I forgot about that. Um, I would like the hospital and the police station maybe to be near the same area. So put one here. Give, give yourself a little bit of room for some footpaths and stuff. Um, how are you going to do trash here? I don't think it will be a problem. You can put trash on the on the corners and everything will be fine. Um, let's get a police station in here as well. Um, sure, the, the exit can be on that side. And there you go. Should be fine. Should be fine. They're kind of touching, but they're kind of not. So I think they will be... No, I don't like it. I'm going to have them back to back. I think that looks better. Uh, police station yes you can be right here and we're going to get a footpath in there so let's move you out a little bit that way uh, hospital you can be right here um, with the road connection exactly on the same side like so and uh, then you are not perfectly aligned but why are you not perfectly aligned ah <laughs> uh, that's a little better yep we're going to take that i don't know why it was wrong uh, before but there you go that's fine. Uh, now we can do all our other shin dicks. And I think we're going to do the footpaths on the outside of these two. And one here. Uh, one here. One here. One here. And that will give us enough footpaths to do all the things. So that's there. I would like a university. Which one do we not have yet? We have all of them. Um, let's build a technical university again. This one can be nice and far away from uh, other connections that we already made. This should be totally fine. 200 meters to that side. Yeah, people can actually walk here and that will be good. Uh, yeah, I, I put that right at the edge of the road there because I don't think we're going to continue that. I don't think we need another courthouse or any of these things. Maybe we need another prison eventually, but not right now. City hall, sure, that can be a thing that we build. Build it next to um, the, the radio station. No, the TV station, because why not? That should be fine. And then technical service, yes, we need several. Uh, since this is the main route for deliveries, I think this can be out here a route for trash. Let's just get it connected to something because it has to go somewhere. Um, what, what, ooh, do I need to move trash with rail? That's an excellent question. Wonderful question that I probably should have an answer for, but I don't yet. If we do need to move trash with rail, this may be the place to do it, which then means let's add a couple waste transfer stations with claws, just the big ones. 
Uh, we just need claws. We don't need the real one. Okay. Uh, or we can do even the smaller one with claws, but no. Um, how about we do this? Put you... Can we actually... Oh, we can align you this way. Oh, that's great. Uh, put a couple here because I don't know how many we actually need. Uh, it's just three because it's a big city. And I guess we have different materials at our waist, so... Let's get these connected. That's fine. And get a road connection right through you guys. Like so. And now we have all of those connected. Then waste from the technical service office could probably just go straight to here. Put a little plop there. Um, what do we have? We need a waste transfer station. Good. Um, this is just to pick up stuff or to drop. This is just to drop off stuff, not to pick up stuff. Okay. I did hear that you can actually move waste with the cargo station, so how about we just try that, road cargo station. Um, I'm okay with just dropping off, and then the pickup can happen via distribution office here. Distribution office for the whole city, it's probably in this area anyways, will be... Oh, we do have smaller distribution offices, good. This one is just responsible for waste. Uh, just move all the waste out to that area, and then we can move that to our recycling plant, if that's a thing. Otherwise, we're just going to plop a... Um, incinerator somewhere in this area and then life would be good so move all those things around why is this one the only one that's not aligned with the road that is an excellent question that we're just going to solve like so um there you go well if you do this may as well do this uh, because then your technical service can probably get to this a little faster okay so that can go there next one for utilities get you uh flip you around and uh, this is our technical service that is responsible for mostly trash and probably a little bit of rail, not rail, uh, but road clearance. And we can actually fit another one here. If we can fit that one there, I would much rather um, turn it around because I think that will look better. No, no, this is fine because we already flipped the other one. So now the sheds are pointing at each other. Yeah, that's great. Look at that stuff. Okay, so technical services, trash, all of that stuff can go here, and they would take these roads normally to get to wherever they need to go. And ideally, I would like this road to connect to uh, this somewhere whenever it's appropriate, which doesn't have to be right away. But that's fine. So now they can take that route to do their trash. We have the other route here that can do um, normal resources. Okay, that's good. How much more city stuff do we need? Well, utilities, obviously. Um, it's not a huge city, so just two or three of them should probably be fine. If I put one on this corner, um, that may be good. One on this corner should be fine. Oh yeah, this, this is going to be easy. One on this corner and the last one somewhere over here. Got to figure out where most of my residential buildings are. I think it's going to be in this general area, so if I could... Well, it could also be here because we have nothing else there yet. Yes, that's right. Let's just move this over here. And that's going to be our general heat coverage. We may have some shortage of heat here. Okay, in that case, let's just move this around. Get it there. Because the because of the arrangement of this whole loopy thing, uh, we should be able to cover the whole city with these three heating plants. And I'm not planning on going too much bigger than what this, can, this one can actually support. So now if we do this with the cinema right here, we can actually give you a nice road connect road connection right there. Very good. And everyone else should still be happy. I think that is that's excellent. All right. Yeah, utilities are a big one, uh, but really everything that we have left is just residential buildings. What have we not built yet? Um, I think we can go a little different this time. So I need 7,500. Cool. Um, let's start just building a couple of things this is what this is 165 call it 150 to make my math a little easier so two gives me three of these so let's do um one this 300 450 um 600 750 it's gonna work we don't have a school yet that's fine 750 950 um 1200 1350 and the last one can go right here this is <laughs> how did i forget already um 1200 right one two three four five six seven eight nine no so 300 
600, 900, uh, 1200, and uh, 1350. Okay, um, let's give that a name so I don't forget. Do, 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 let's create city area. This is going to be 1350. Cool. Still needs footpath, still needs uh, trash, still needs all that stuff taken care of. Uh, and that should be fine. So that's the first one. Um, this should work really, really nicely, actually. Uh, the second one can be a different style. We can go really wide. Oh, hold on. I didn't look at the quality. Quality of flats is in this one. 90% perfect so that will work 85% is also fine for this it may be in style that we already built somewhere though so maybe not not that one 75 75 75 we can't go that low I need higher percentages this one though this one will be fine um let's do parallel to that road okay one what is this also 150 ish 160 sure so 300 600 900 and uh 1150 and we're not going to make it super tight so we're now at almost a third of our population okay so three six nine eleven fifty no ten fifty i don't know why why my math is so hard so that one can go there and let's do another group over here there isn't a lot of room right there and i think we're gonna plop our school right into there i don't think we need anything but the the normal long school and the other one is also a big square which i don't want to plop down so pop this one right here and then we have that one taken care of we need kindergartens but i'm i wouldn't be surprised if we just put a kindergarten everywhere on the outskirts and let them figure out how they're going to get there because there is a lot a lot of room there uh to do all the things that we need to do so more residential stuff cool what is this 89 and 89 percent yes i like it um let's give me actually let's try this i haven't done that in a very very long time not scripts not time lapse uh not this show overlay make city yes i would like um this one and i would also like this one and uh place building home selection qe to switch buildings okay so if i put this one here I want to put this one, sure, here, here. I'm just using Q and E to do this. Uh, and then we're just going to go opposite of that. So there, there, there. We can't do that one. That's fine. And that's it, right? Is that pretty? I don't know, but it, it kind of lines up with something. <laughs> um, so we're going to do that. How many people was this? This was... 300 and 200 so each two together are about 500 so uh five a thousand a thousand fifteen hundred and then eighteen hundred almost eighteen hundred people in those that's 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 crazy but okay uh let's do this call this eighteen hundred cool and now where are we at we are at twenty eight hundred uh call it thir three thousand four thousand so we're about halfway there and halfway filled up the city i think this is this is going really really well let's see residential areas what else do we have 91 percent. i haven't built these in a very long time so how about we just do uh i just I, go away I just i just want to build these uh, okay should we i think this is fine align it with the outside and then we can get somewhere what is this 300 something no 189 uh, so let's call this 400, 600, um, 900, what? 600, 800, uh, 1,000, and uh, the last one is not going to fit here unless I move this thing somewhere. And I think I want to move that swimming pool just a little bit to get a little more stuff out of this. So make this 900, and then swimming pool, where would you like to go? I know that you still fit in here. I'd be very surprised if that was a real issue. Um, that's fine. Right there is good. So, uh, what was this? <laughs> um, two hundred each. Okay, two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve hundred. So let's call us like eleven hundred to make sure that I'm not overcounting something. Cool. So, where are we at now? We were at four thousand earlier. Three thousand. Uh, four thousand. Yep. And uh, now 5,000, so just a little bit more room. I like the city. Someone was complaining that they didn't want me to make monotone-looking cities. That's fine. That's what I'm trying right now. So um, let's see how this goes. 
We can still do the normal bricks. This is more of a fancy, fancy place of town. And I think I'm going to do this just a little different. Flip you around. Have the outside sitting right there. And then one uh, flip. Rot rot. Flip and rotate. Two. Um, what is this? 300? Yes. 300 people on that one. Let's clone this. Nope. Not the, not the road. Just clone these. 300... Um, 600, um, 900, and then I guess we could try to put one more here and just call it good there. Footpaths are going to be a little bit of a problem, especially since that one is kind of awkward, um, but we're just going to make it work. Hmm. I think i rather align these and then clone them again. Okay, you... Uh, definitely rotate. Yeah, I think that looks better. And then this, if we want to, can also align just fine. Okay, there you go. Still the same thing. Uh, three, six, nine, twelve hundred. Okay, we're almost there. Not clone name. Uh, this is twelve hundred. When when we're done with everything, I can unname all of these. Otherwise, the city. Um, the, like the, the office building doesn't really work, but that's fine. So now we are at, we were at 5,000, now we're at 6,000. So we just need a few more people here. It's right in front of the TV, TV station. So I don't think we need anything crazy. Let's see if we can get any of these in because these are really nice and high density. Only 83% happiness. This one is really good though. 90% happiness. I think we just built them. 70, no. This one, that's new. 75, 90, that's also new, or 100 for 90. This, I, I'm pretty sure we haven't built this one before, so that's that's the last one. These are 100 each, uh, the way it looks, so let's just, nope, not aligned right. Uh, try again. Okay, one. It's not even close. <laughs> uh, that is better. I don't think it's perfect yet, but that's better. Uh, one. Two, three. Let's do four right here, and then we're just gonna redo the other ones. I'm I'm okay with keeping them alternating. Uh, we should have more than enough footpath. No, I don't have footpath room on this side at all to actually make them adjust the right way. So we're just gonna go further back. One, two, three, and get those, and then we do one, two three and then the last one one can't get one in there so make this closer if you make that closer you have to move the second row back okay uh let's just move the second row back then <laughs> uh and this one can go right here and the second row um what do we want to do here okay this is fine um this is fine this is fine be nice if I can put four in the back there. Let's do that. Okay. So this is this was a hundred each, right? Yes. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So another nine hundred on top of that. The numbers that we get from the buildings are not the final numbers because children and those uh, numbers are counted differently. But I think this is fine. Now we're at what? 900, 2,000, at 3,500, 4,600, 54, 6,400, and 75, uh, 7,600. So perfect. 7,600 is what we wanted. We have a lot of space on the outside. We have a bunch of footpaths that we can do. So that all should work pretty well. We just need to actually get everything planned. And I think we can do that just fine. I, I think I'm excited to see how the city turns out. Uh, again, we still need utilities, we need, still need power, we still need water, we still need a lot of stuff that's not going to be done anytime soon, but I think it's a pretty good, solid start. All these things are doing what they're supposed to do. I'm excited for those. Construction offices, what are you doing? Um, the rail construction office is not actually doing all the things that I wanted you to do or want you to do. So how about you? Talk to me. Construction office, what are you not working on? I would like you to go out here and out here. And what else do we get? 
Okay, you, you can you can continue all the construction that you want because then you can start from the back as well. But this is working pretty good right here. We'd like the rail on that side to come, to get started a little sooner, but I think we're good. What are we doing here? Hour eleven? Yeah, sure, <laughs> it's fine. Um, yeah, we're expanding. We're doing the things, and I think we're gonna. This construction shouldn't take super long because I can just as long as I have the amenities done. Uh, I can get all the other things started with people just in the city and then slowly expand from there. And that should be, that should be fine. I may even use underground wires for this situation. Looks like we have most of the rail done on this side. This is already assigned. That's lovely. This thing we could probably assign if we wanted to, <laughs> just to get it done. Uh, but we don't have to. Nope. This looks really good. Um, I think the next thing for construction of us two is be, will be get food set up if they want to. Um, we would also like to get gravel set up. That will be that'll be a thing in the near future. I'm just not ready for that quite yet. We don't have a lot of construction going on over here. Okay, are oh, you almost done with this? Nice. Uh, let's get whatever else is still missing here. So I, I would love to turn this on uh, just next time. And I'm sure it's gonna take me a little bit of brain power to actually figure out what I, what I messed up there. So let's not overdo that. Um, this all looks good. You're looking fine. We don't have any nuclear nuclear fuel just waiting there for us but we have a couple trucks that already have 1.4 million loaded 300,000 loaded yeah that's good stuff there is one of those waiting this is nice we did get all most of this done construction obviously still missing that i guess we're doing the power line now too no we really don't have to you nope <laughs> go away um yeah just more construction obviously construction of us two you can probably get assigned to more stuff on this side uh, I don't even know what. What do you want me to do? Great question. Uh, how about these power things? And yeah, sure, some more construction offices because they can. It's hard for them to build themselves. This works. This is fine. This gets us everything that we need and uh, and more. So thank you so much for watching. I will see you again next time. Rail is being done just like we needed to and everything else will just continue. I'm happy with where we are. I'll see you again next time. Bye-bye.